welcome to my channel and welcome to another Kmart haul. Yes, another Kmart haul. I love Kmart hauls and so do you guys. So I'm coming at you with another one. Today I'm going to be showing you some home decor kitchen items. So if you're excited to see this video, thumbs up, subscribe down below to see more and let's get into the video. <music> The first thing I want to show you is this smoothie kitchen book that I picked up that was only $5. It is a hardcover book and quite thick as well. It has, it's 255 pages long, so a lot of content in this book. Um, but I really want to get into smoothies. I think it's a healthy alternative um, to do like a meal replacement or even just to add extra veggies into your diet. Um, that you can't get into like solid foods. So I wanted to have a look at this book and see if I can get some inspiration ideas for smoothie meals. So I picked up this book. The next thing I picked up is this glass takeaway coffee cup. I've got plastic ones of these, um, but I've done a lot of research on plastic and and eating from plastic that has been heated at a very high temperature, which usually when you're having a hot drink like this, it is at a very high temperature because you're having a hot tea or coffee in them. So it can leak some chemicals into the plastic and then obviously into your system, which isn't safe and good for you. So I wanted to get a glass one. So this is the one I picked up. I will leave the price somewhere on the screen because I don't remember all the prices for these. Um, but yeah, it's just your normal, typical coffee cup. It looks like that. I thought it was super cute because it is pink and girly. You can get black ones, I believe, in these as well. So if you don't want a pink one, they have like normal neutral colors as well. The next thing I picked up is a bit random and may have been a bit of a waste of money because I don't know how long this is going to last for. But I wanted to try it anyways because we do actually need a new saucepan. But we need to invest in something a bit nicer. But for the meantime, I just bought this here. It's a 28 centimeter fry pan and it looks like this. I believe this was 13 or 15 dollars. Again, I'll leave the price somewhere here up on the screen. This is got an aluminium body, three layer nonstick coating um, and it can be used on different oven tops. So yeah, we'll see how this, um, we'll see how long this lasts, but we just need something in the meantime um, while we're looking at like a nice expensive set to invest in. The next thing I've got that I was super excited about, and I don't know how long Kmart have actually had these in stock for, whether it is a new product, but it's like a Lazy Susan. So I've seen these everywhere, but they've always been so expensive to get, and now Kmart have them as well. So really cool. This is called a storage turntable. That's the way Kmart are naming this, but I know it as a Lazy Susan. I can't get it to focus. Anyways, I don't know if that's focusing. But again, I'll leave the price here. It's super inexpensive. And I'm excited to organize my pantry with this. You can even use this in the fridge for like your sauces and things like that. So they're not always falling behind um, on the shelf. You can just put all your sauces in here and spin it to find which one you want. So I love the idea of this and I'm excited that I have one now for myself to organize my pantry or my fridge. The next thing is also a pretty random thing that I got, but it's also something that I've been looking for around the store, but I haven't actually found one or thought to look for it because it's just such a random product. But it's this thing here. Now comment below before I go on with this video and tell me what you think this is used for. It's silicon material. It's got these grooves here as well. Let me know in the comments if you know what this is for. This is actually a spoon rest. So this is used when you're cooking and you need to stir something occasionally and then put the spoon back down and then go and check on it again and you know stir it again. This is so you can rest your spoon um, onto this little mat here and it won't go all over your kitchen bench and it's hygienic and clean and yeah I thought this was a really cool idea and I haven't seen one that has multiple grooves. I've only seen one for one spoon so really cool if you're doing multiple dishes um, on your stovetop and you've got 
different spoon stirrers. So yeah, really cool idea and super inexpensive. Again, price will be up here. The next thing I've got is the most random thing ever and it is just some clothes pegs. I'm constantly running out of these and I find the Kmart ones are probably the ones that last the longest, funnily or not. These are only $3 each for a pack of 24 pegs. Um, but I'm always breaking them. I keep them outside on the washing line, so that's probably why they don't last very long, especially during summer because we do get very harsh weather. Um, but these are the ones I do prefer to use, so I picked up a pack of two. The next thing for the kitchen, and I think this is the last thing for the kitchen as well, is just a five-piece kitchen set that looks like this. So you get one, like, glove to take out hot things from the stove, and then you get two of these pot holders that looks like this. And then you also get two, I think it's two tea towels, like that. So I really liked the print on this. And the one I have at the moment in my kitchen is actually from Kmart as well. Um, but I feel like the the actual mitten part of it is smaller and it's just got, it's gone really grubby. No matter how many times I've washed it, it just won't come out. So it was time to get another one. So I picked myself up one of these. The next thing I've got is more like personal items for me. Um, I've got this lip treatment with chia seed oil. I've always wanted to try one of these lip treatments. It's like a lip scrub. Especially now that it is autumn, I know my lips are going to get very dry and cracked. So I thought this would be a great little treatment for my lips when that does happen. Um, and I'm just curious to see how I find this as well because I've seen this around in the market for some time now but I've never actually tried it myself. Let me know if you've actually tried this product and if you liked it. There was a different range as well. It, it was like a pink background. I'm not sure. Um, I think there was just different ingredients in it but I liked that this had chia seed oil in it and it was all natural um, ingredients. Um, it's got infused with peppermint oil as well. So I think it's very refreshing. So let me know if you have tried this particular one. I would love to know what your feedback is on this. Next thing is, and it's the last thing for myself, is a journal. So this is the journal I picked up. If you've seen my other haul videos from Kmart, you'll know I got a little pencil case with this print, some pens, and maybe even a phone case. Like I've, I just love this print here. And they also stock like a print that you can put on the wall with this design. So really cool. I do really like this design here. And this is just an empty journal for me to write some notes on there. I'm going to either use this for YouTube ideas or even just to put some ideas down for a new online business that I'm working on at the moment. And the next two items are just for my daughter. Again, these are still organization things except for this one here. These are just a pack of... 600 clear little elastics this is what I'm currently using in her hair because the hair is so fine and still quite short so this is what holds her hair best at the moment so I just picked this up for her she does have one with all the colored bands but I just wanted a clear one as well and to go with that my biggest item for the day is this here I don't hope that's in the frame this is a very big, sturdy wooden organizer with little drawers that come out like that. They've got four like square style drawers there and then one big rectangle one here that's nice and deep and can hold a lot of things. And you could actually paint this and design it the way you like. What I'm going to do with this is probably leave it the way it is, but I'm going to be using this to organize my daughter's hair accessories, elastics, hair brushes, and all that. She's got so many now, and I know it's just going to get worse as she gets older with all the hair bows and clips and all that. So she really needed something that's going to be, you know, put into one spot. Um, because at the moment I have all these individual little storage things for her and it's just hard to find things. I've got to try and find where, the, where I put her elastics and where I put her clips. So I thought that this would be a good solution for that. I could put maybe hair elastics in here, clips in here, bows in here, hair brushes in here 
and so forth. So I'm sure I'll work it out as I get organizing, but I thought this would be a really good organization thing for her bedroom. And this was $15. So really good deal considering that it is quite heavy. My arm's actually getting sore holding this. Like this video as well and I'll see you in my next one. Bye everyone.